To create an SMS template, start by opening the Templates app by using the app drawer in the top right of the screen. Underneath the app drawer, click on New Template. Then click on SMS Template. An empty form will appear with various prompts for text entries. The title is the name of your SMS template. This is for your personal records and it is required. You should also enter a brief description that informs you and your team of what type of content is within the template for its general purpose. The description field is required. The message field is where you will input the text that you intend to send your contacts. As you enter text, a preview will appear on the right showing what your message will look like to the recipient. As an important note, the message field for SMS templates utilizes one credit for every 160 characters. You will utilize another credit each time you exceed that character limit. For example, a message with 50 characters uses one credit, but a message with 162 characters will use two credits. At the bottom of the message field, you will see the button that says Personalize. Click this. You will now see a list of a number of predefined categories you can use to personalize the template to the specific contact that is receiving the message. For example, the first option category that appears is called Business. This contains a, a number of unique identifiers related to that business such as business name, phone number, email address, and so on. Let's select business name. You will now see the text business, business name. However, the receiver will not see this text, but will instead see their own business name as you have it within their contact record. For example, if we're sending this SMS to Joe's Plumbing, then the body of the message will read, Hello, Joe's Plumbing. They will not see this personalization text. As you scroll through these options, you can see that you have personalization options for business, person, any information you have in Insta Sites or Insta Reports, and also for your own personal records. As a warning, if you do not have the necessary data stored within your contacts on your account, the system will not be able to inject the data. For example, if we do not have Joe's Plumbing as a business contact record, this personalization option will not work when sending the email. However, we now have a new feature called Fallback to protect you from this. In the event that our system cannot find the business name as requested, you can enter a fallback value. Just as an example, we'll say our fallback value is there. What this means is that if we cannot find a business name, instead of saying, hello, Joe's Plumbing, it would simply say, hello there. This protects you from sending any awkward or accidental messages to your clients without the correct information. As an additional warning, notice this message. Credits may vary due to personalizations. This warning appears because of the character limit discussed earlier. We do not know at the time how many characters a personalization option will use when sending an email. It is up to you to be mindful of this when thinking about your character limits. At the bottom, you can test an SMS template before using it. Send the number you would like to send a test message to, then click Send Test. As a final note, 
Test submissions of text messages will cost credits. So be aware of your credit balance before conducting tests. When you're satisfied with your SMS template, be sure to click save in the top right corner.